Welcome guys. In today's video, we will learn how we can remove an item from recycler view. The purpose behind this uh, technique is, for example, if you have a to-do list or some list of notes that you have created in your app and you want to delete a particular item that you don't need uh, anymore or maybe in any other situations like a list of any other things that you are already showing in your app and you want to delete it and this will include also that from where you can remove it as well from your database or your uh, you can make an api call as well where you want to make an update online so let's see how we can do this uh, as you remember this is our recent project in which we were working we have a list of countries and currently uh, adapter is directly attached to the recycler view and this adapter includes a click listener that is included with uh, item view and this passes the click this particular method it passes the click to our activity and here we can make our actions that are important for us so here most of the things are ready but we need a method first of all so let's make the method we need actually two methods here currently we are notifying the adapter that you know the data is already set and changed so you need to update the recycler view this is actually happening during initialization that's why we are having uh, it inside init block but for now we will remove it because we don't need it anymore we will create a new method we need two method one for updating the view with the data when it is attached another is we need to update the view on a particular index that the item is removed so let's create the method update data you can name it anything you want we need position as well no we need we don't need position here we just need to call the notify data set change in this that's it the another one is for removing the data a particular position okay so item removed at update list we also need a position over here to let the adapter know that this is the particular position notify item removed at position okay so here we are done with our important stuff inside recycler view adapter and another part is here we need to prepare our uh, activity to handle the changes for example here we have an adapter and we need to create separate instances for adapter and the array list both so let's do that first of all we will take it out okay let's create an instance for adapter i will just make a copy this is control plus d uh, to make a duplicate of a current line okay so this is an adapter okay and add a list that we need for our uh, adapter to be passed inside add a list of type string okay now we will assign the initialization and data to the adapter let's do that first of all we will connect the adapter recycler view adapter equal to we will put the adapter data okay 
and we also need to update the data okay so array list and this is not initialized yet late init were is not initialized yet so we need to initialize that as well array list this is initialized now we will make a clear in case we, we have any garbage value and we will just do add all and we will add the data that's it and we will pass the array list inside our adapter that's all our adapter is ready now and we are now connecting our adapter here and we will just notify the adapter that you know the data is passed and you just need to make an update in your view okay update it that's all for here and now we will update the data on the trigger of click so here as you know that we have a click listener that is passing the click to this function with a current index position okay so we will use this we will first of all remove the item from our database so remove at position okay this thing that we are doing here removing at position is for the array list for example if you have this array list taken from a database you can update it here with this trigger and after that we will update our view as well we will take the adapter and okay that method that we have created inside our recycler view adapter so we are passing the position to let the know to let the adapter know that we have removed the item here before doing this updating the view here you can make your api call to update in your server or you can do it in your website uh, sorry i mean database as well so here i think we are good to go we are ready to check okay so let's see how it works okay so here you can see that we have our list of countries that is showing inside our recycler view using the recycler view adapter now if i click on a particular item it will get removed including removed in your stored data so okay wherever i will click it will disappear it's very simple we are getting the click from here we are passing it using this interface method and this method is passing to the activity this click is received inside the activity inside using this method and this method is handling remaining operation that is removing from the database or api wherever you want to do it you can do it here and then updating the ui when it is successfully uh, executed whatever operations you want to do in your database side or uh, server side okay so that's how it works okay so I think th that's enough for this tutorial and I hope you like the video thank you for watching see you next time